my channel, my phone go friends. So guys, today, whoo! So little backstory. I just checked the mail and I had this huge package sitting on my doorstep. And when I say huge, I mean like you thought that the '90s boxes were big, especially the most recent one I did. No, this thing is probably twice the size of the 90s box and I'm so excited because it's just I can already tell that it's gonna contain amazingness um so it's from a very good lifelong friend of mine from California named Jana Jana is just such a gem and has been there for me through thick and thin so she told me that she was sending me a birthday package and to expect it uh, Monday or Tuesday but she didn't tell me what's inside so honestly guys this is probably going to be the most epic unboxing I've ever done. This is probably the most epic mystery box. And when I say mystery box, I honestly know nothing. I know nothing that's inside this box. She gave me no clues, no hints, no pointers. Um, like I said, she's a lifelong friend, so she knows me very well. I know that she's a fan of the YouTube channel. So I asked her when she told me she was sending me the box, can I unbox it on my channel? And she said, yeah, sure, absolutely. Please go for it. So... Just first and foremost before I even dive into this, Jana, thank you so much. Just I have so much love for you, my dear. You know that I respect you, I appreciate you, I value you, and just thank you for all that you do. You really did not have to do anything for me, but especially this. Just Oh gosh, the shipping alone! I don't know. Ah, you're awesome. You rock. That's all I can say. Uh, she spent a lot on shipping, and I told her that she didn't have to do that, but you know, she said, I want to. I really appreciate you, and you've done a lot for me, so just. I never expect anything in return. I really don't. And I wasn't expecting any kind of birthday package. So, alright, enough of my chit chat. Let's dive in, guys. So, when I told you that it was bigger than the 90s box, look at this thing. This thing is huge. I don't even know if you could see my face, honestly. This thing is, you know what we're going to do? We're actually going to get rid of, we're not going to get rid of the rolling carpet. We're just going to roll that out of the way because honestly, I feel like this box is going to block my face. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to put this on the floor and I'm just going to dive in. So it honestly, it has not been opened. Normally I crack open my boxes, but I wanted to do this with you guys. So that it's, first and foremost, it's taped very well. So it definitely arrived to me safely. So first and foremost, thank you, Jana, for the amazing, excellent packaging. I hope that everybody is having a good day today. I gotta be careful because I don't know. She said that she packed it full, so I don't know if anything's close to like the top or what. So I gotta be very careful. Remember, kids, safety first. I need to invest in a box cutter. Um, I know I probably make a lot of my viewers nervous with these scissors. So I'm not looking inside. I'm just. Oh shit, I hope I didn't slice something. Okay. Alright. Okay, no. Ooh. Okay, we're good. I saw this and I got nervous that I sliced something. Okay. Let's... Alright, so hopefully everyone's having a good day. Like I said, I honestly know nothing about what's in this box. It could be Funko Pops. It could be clothes. It could be sentimental things that have been made for me because she has made me quite a few things. I honestly don't know. So this is a true to form mystery box. And like I said, we're going to dive in. So my my desk is a little high, so I don't want it to block. So, um, so like I said, we're just going to put this on the floor and we're just going to kind of dive in. When I see, you'll see. Okay, so we're going in, guys. We're diving in. Oh man, I'm so anxious, I'm so excited. When she told me she was sending me something, I told her that I was so anxious and excited and I didn't know what to expect. And like I said, she has given me no clues, no hints, no pointers. So, oh my god. Okay, so, first and foremost, guys, first and foremost, anyone that knows me knows that I'm an Office fan. This is the first thing that I see when I open the box. Oh my god, I'm dying. Oh I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that whatsoever. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's multiple copies of it. Oh my god. Oh, I'm, I'm dying. I'm roll. There's like six copies in here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. This was a nice touch. This was a nice touch. Oh my god. Oh my god, the phone number on pervert Dwight Poster is not a sex hotline. Oh my god, that's 
funny. Oh my god. And like I said, there's just six, there's like a couple more. He's we're pulling the bubble wrap off. So, again, we have a few more. So, okay, so we've got a few of these. Got a few more. All right, so, I'm starting to see a few things. So, we've got a couple boxes, some sorters, some question marks, and some things in our wrap. But first and foremost, we have a letter. Now, I just want to let you guys know, first and foremost, that there's a good chance that I might get emotional. Because, like I said, Jana has been there for me through thick and thin. Um, she was there uh, in a really low point in my life, and she helped me out. She helped me out of the rut, so I'm really going to try my best not to get emotional, but uh, I can't make any promises. Okay, Mikey, where do I even begin? You make my heart so happy, and you are such a bright and positive soul. You bring so much joy to my life, and I would like to say thank you from the bottom of my little heart. Just thanks for being you, showing up, and not holding back. You are an inspiration to us all. One of the best pages on Instagram that I ever followed, six years and counting, for great memes, music, and positive vibes, and of course, pugs, which I think is our most shared love. I am so thankful for, <clears throat> for the flow you post of amazing photos of Athena, the moon goddess, the pop punk pug, the Funko pop pug. You both bring so much joy to me. Please never let the world harden you. Show them that beautiful smile and live your best life. Thank you. I've got nothing but love for you always, Jana. Oh yeah, in the box, lots of great stuff. I am not a pop expert like you at all. Haha. -ha. But I sent you some that I like and thought you would like and one chase exclusive limited edition and one of a kind pop hope you like oh all right so i'm excited so i had a feeling that there would be some pops i don't know what just because like she follows my channel so jana thank you so much like first and foremost this letter is amazing and you always you always know how to pull out the heartstrings so just thank you for the honest and sincere letter, I truly appreciate it. And this is something that I will hold dear with me for the rest of my life. And I love cards, I love letters, I love anything. So especially like handwritten, man. Like handwritten letters and notes are a lost art form for sure. So that warms my heart so much. So, all right. So when I look into the box, guys, let's see if I can hold this stuff without. This is what I see. This is what I see. So I see a couple things. So. Let's go with this. We got a couple question mark things. So let's go with this question mark thing. Let's see. All right. Let's dive inside, guys. Let's see. Let's wrap twice. Should have brought a garbage bag over here. Oh, well. We've got... What is this? Oh, it's cereal. Funko cereal. Okay. There's a surprise enamel pin inside. So that's cool. I didn't know that Funko cereal came in, like, mini versions. That's cool. So that's different. I'm excited about that. Um... I really wish I had a trash bag over here. Oh, well, I'm just going to throw it over there. Throw it on the couch. All right. So we have another question mark item. So let's see what this is. Where's my... Oh, there we go. I thought I was going to need my scissors, but I don't. Sticker. Hey! Oh, that's awesome! Aw. I'm pretty sure these are, like, um, car decals. So we've got Mikey Vintage. We've got Bald Little Me in pop form. We got Athena, the Funko Pop Pug, and then we have smaller versions of that. So very cool. So little decals of myself and the Funko Pop Pug. That's exciting. Aww. All right, we got a piece of clothing. What is this? <gasps> what? No, come on. Really? Is this, is this for real? Yo, she made me like, that's awesome. So I... So she ordered me, or made, a custom Mikey Vintage hoodie with the Funko crown. That's awesome. Yo, and it's so soft, too. Oh, my God. Okay, so I live in Michigan, and the winter months can be very brutal. So I am, I am, oh, and there's little crowns on the sleeves, too. That's awesome. I'm so excited about that. So, oh, it gets cold in the wintertime, so I am so excited to wear that. So thank you for hooking your boy up. All right, so we've got... They're numbered, so I guess I'm going to go in order. So we've got number one right here. All right. <clears throat> we've got... Hey! Okay. We've got Voltron! Voltron! Very cool. Awesome. I don't have that. Um, as you said in your note, you may not be a Funko Puff expert, but that's okay. You know what? The fact that you took the time to pick out things for me 
just means the world. So I already know that I will love and appreciate and adore anything and everything. So we have number two. So number two, guys, let's dive inside. Let's see what this one is. Whoa, okay. We got Jafar, Red Jafar as Genie from Aladdin. Very cool, I'm excited about that. So that's from the OG 90s Disney movie. So that's awesome, I'm excited about that. Tons of bubble wrap, so as I said, amazing packaging. I'm still, man, every time I look over, all I see is this. I am just, man, that's funny. Okay, damn, packed. All right, so they're numbered. All right, so there's a box in here. I feel like I should say that for last. There's a big box in here. So we got number three. This is like just the fact that you took the time. So these are wrapped twice, not just once. These are wrapped twice. So there's two individual. So wrapping anything once takes time. The fact that she wrapped this twice, girl, I know that you put. Hey, okay, so this is Artemis. Artemis from Ready Player One, the GameStop exclusive. Awesome. So, so far, I don't have any of these, and that's awesome. Even if I did, I still adore these, and I appreciate them, and I appreciate you. So, man, it is just part of it all over my face. Yo! No way! Ah! It's the Invisible Man Walgreens exclusive. I have literally been looking for this. There's about five Walgreens in town, and I've been to every single one. Looking for this, looking for like the Dracula, looking for the Uncle Fester, and I cannot find them. So, that's awesome. I, I saw the top when I first opened it. That, I'm so excited about that. Okay, man, you are just knocking it out of the park, Jana. You are too good to me. Alright, what is this one? Let's see. So we got, again, like I said, double paper on each of these, so that is not easy. We got the Target exclusive Jerry. Is he holding, I don't know if that's... Oh, I thought it was Salami, but he's holding TNT. That's awesome. So Jerry from Tom and Jerry, the, the Target exclusive. Just, again, continuing to knock it out of the park. All right, so we got number six, guys. Number six. All right. All right, so this one I'm opening from the bottom, so I truly don't know what it is. All right, so we've got... Okay, so we got Arnold. We got Arnold, the GameStop exclusive. He's in the banana suit from uh, the play. I think there's one of Gerald in a... Yep, there's one of Gerald in a strawberry outfit. So GameStop exclusive. That's awesome. All right, so we got one more pop, and then we've got a box. And then, wait, there's something else in here. I don't know what that is, but I'll have to get to that at the very end. Okay, open... Wait, open last? It says open last. So... Last of the Pops? I'm not sure. Okay, there's bigger stuff in here, so I feel like it's open last as, like, pop-wise. What is this? express right now how thankful I am for you and the fact that you did any of this you didn't have to do this but like oh my god okay so guys she may <laughs> thank you just thank you so much you don't understand like <sighs> you are more than just a friend to me you have been there, like I said, through thick and thin, and I cannot thank you enough, and I can't say enough good things about you. You have just been in my life in some of the hardest times, and gosh, I really was going to try not to get emotional, but this is just above and beyond. Like, you didn't have to do any of this stuff, but this is just this is so, like, amazing. Like, there are no words that I could say right now that can express my love for you and my gratitude and just thankful that our paths crossed and that you came into my life and you had just been such an amazing person, just such a kind-hearted person. Like, oh, okay, sorry. I told you I couldn't make any promises. Okay, so, guys, she made me an exclusive Funko Pop of Athena. So it says Mikey Vintage in place of Funko. It's got Athena with the bow. 
It's got a convention exclusive and a GameStop exclusive. So it's got Athena. It's got a Janna Mapri exclusive. And then Funko, Athena, Mikey Vintage. Just So she custom made... She had a custom pop made for me. This is just like above and beyond, guys. Like, let me give it one more spin. I was not expecting this at all. Just thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Just not only for this, but just for being such a kind-hearted person. This is going to be on display, like, always. I am I love that. I love it so much. Thank you so much. Like, I didn't mean for my emotions to get the best of me, but just thank you for everything that you do daily for others, everything that you've done for me, even though you didn't have to. Just... Thank you. I cannot say it enough. There's no words or way that I could ever express or convey to you how important you are, how amazing you are to me, how thankful and grateful that I am that you came into my life. And just this package is amazing. And just thank you. Uh, like, I could probably say it a hundred times more. Thank you. All right, so we got another box. Let's, let's move along because I know that I got a little, uh, a little emotional with that. All right, what is this? Let's sleep. Yeah. Hey, okay, so we've got it says ah, I think it has a Harry Potter spell on here. It has a Harry Potter spell written on here. And there's something inside. What is this? Yes. Are you serious? That's awesome. So it's a Draco Malfoy Slytherin uh, pocket pop, keychain pop. That's awesome. I'm just going to start putting stuff over here because I'm running out of room over here. Alright, so awesome. So what, what it came in was a ceramic mug. Okay, so we've got a ceramic mug. Very cool. And then it says Funko Pop. There's that. And then we have... Is this Athena? I think I think it's Athena. That's awesome. Like I said, great packing job. Everything arrived to me safely, which I had hoped that it would, but you made certain of that. So Mikey Vintage. And then we've got Athena, the Funko Pop Pug. That's awesome. So we got... Some new ceramic mugs, guys. I guess that means there's going to be a new intro soon. I'm thinking so. I'm thinking we're going to have to film a new intro. All right. Colby! All right, sorry. I'm trying to make myself laugh after all the tears. So thank you for sticking in there with me. I know it's kind of a long video. We're getting down towards the end. I think there's one more thing in here, maybe. There's something that's heavy down at the bottom. What is this? What is this? Okay. So, it, it could be a table, maybe, or maybe she's punking me, I don't know. Um, is this a table? It, maybe it is a table, I don't know, let's, let's crack it open. So this is the last thing in the box, guys, let's see what it is inside. Let's grab the scissors. So we got a new table. Very cool. So we got, I'm not going to take it all out, but it is actually a table. It's actually a table for like putting stuff on, like the ceramic mugs, and I can do my videos from this table. So awesome, amazing, incredible. Hands down, this is the best mystery box that I have ever received. Like no other Funko box, no other 90s box compares to this. You hit the nail on the head with everything. Like, you are a pug lover, much like myself. You know how much Athena means to me, and you know how incredible it is that she came into my life. So the fact that you acknowledge that, you address that, amazing. You hit fandoms that I like, like Nickelodeon, Disney, Monsters, The Office, um, 
Harry Potter, just amazing, 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 amazing. Like I said, I cannot thank you enough. I am so overjoyed, and my heart is so full right now. Just thank you again for everything. No, you did not have to do this, but I will cherish and value and appreciate everything. These pots are probably going on display in the background. These mugs are probably going to be in the new intro video. Just thank you for everything. Thank you for wanting to do this for me. Thank you for just being so kind-hearted and so down-to-earth and just, I can't thank you enough. So thank you also for allowing me to share this with my community, my Funko friends, my Funko family, and thank you for being a part of my Funko Friends Society. And like I said, you are more than just a friend to me. Like, I, th like my heart is just so full right now. I just don't have the words. And there's no way that I could ever say or show or express the thanks that I have for you. But this was just such a pleasant surprise and such an amazing birthday mystery box. And like I said, by far my most amazing birthday, or my most amazing mystery box that I have ever received, ever. So thank you for that. I really appreciate that. Even though you didn't have to do that. just I've probably been rambling. There's, it's been a wave of emotions. So just thank you so much. Thank you, Jana, for this box. Thank you for allowing me to unbox this for my channel. Thank you for everything that was inside. Thank you for being the amazing person that you are inside and out. And just, I appreciate it. And so thank you, everybody, for watching. I appreciate it. Thank you for watching my most epic mystery box ever. What was your favorite poll from inside? What was your favorite thing? I love everything. There's no way I can narrow it down to just one thing. So just thank you so much, Jana. Thank you so much, my Funko friends and family and community for watching. Until next time, guys, collect what you love. Make some Funko friends. Make some friendships that will last a lifetime. Just, wow. Who knew that these things, man, these things could bring people together from all over the world like-minded people, similar interests, people that enjoy the same kind of fandoms and things that you do. Like, I never in my wildest dreams when I first saw the Funko Pop thought this is where it would lead me to. Having a YouTube channel, having people reach out to send me stuff and just people be so, so kind-hearted and just so gracious. Like, I owe a lot to Funko. I know it probably sounds crazy to say, but I owe a lot to Funko because it brought me closer to you guys. It brought me closer to you guys that I may not have known otherwise so just thank you so much jana thank you so much to the community thank you so much everybody for reaching out and just more amazingness yet to come that's what i can leave you with i know it's been a wave of emotions there are more amazing ideas and videos and giveaways the best is still yet to come guys so stay tuned jana once again love you thank you so much honey all right until next time guys happy hunting mikey vintage signing off collect what you love bye guys i wanted to leave you with something to laugh with bye guys what an amazing box. That's a hell of a video.